the Trump immigration plan. Round up and deport more than 11 million people, almost all of whom are employed or are children going to school, then build a wall across our border and force Mexico to pay for it. Now, this policy is not only wrong-headed and unachievable, it is really bad economics. Kicking out 11 million immigrants would cost hundreds of billions of dollars, and it would shrink our economy significantly. Some economists actually argue that just this policy alone would send us into a Trump recession. So instead of causing large-scale misery and shrinking our economy, we should pass sensible immigration reform with a path to citizenship. Because the youth, <laughs> the youth and diversity of our workforce is one of our greatest assets. Most of the rest of the world that we compete with is aging. So by staying you know, younger and fresher with talents that can be put to work, we're actually going to be in a stronger economic position in the next decades. We've always been a country where people born elsewhere could work hard, start businesses, and contribute to our growth. That makes us stronger and more prosperous.